Hi guys, so this is the part two of the exam prep videos. So I'll be carrying on with questions five, six, and seven in this video. And we last left off at phi mix. Um, the diagrams here, we see uh, the free body diagram here, the axial force diagram be bending moment diagram. And what we can see is the axial force diagram, this was our value for n star for instance, and the m star from this, so the highest values. And using this information, we'll carry on with phi mix and the calculation. So phi mix equals this formula, phi msx, uh, and n star over n cx. So that's the difference here, rel, uh, compared to phi mrx. We used phi ns. So phi msx equals 242.7 kilonewton meters. And N phi ns equals 1,947 kilonewtons. Uh, for these values, I uh, went through them in the previous video and showed how you would calculate them. I would recommend you watch that if you uh, are just watching the second video now. So phi ncx equals phi alpha c ns. So lex equals l. And that's something I covered in the first video where I said the in-plane... Um, length uh, for in plane um, magnetic length for uh, basically that column was L. So that means it's 4,000 millimeters. So now what we have is 4,000 